My name is Muhammad Saad and I am from Pakistan and I am a PhD student from the 2021 batch at Ningxia Medical University. I have been studying in China for more than 8 years. In my spare time, I like photography best. In recent years, I have been to so many places in China such as Sanya in Hainan, Xi'an in Xiangxi, Wuzhong, Zhongwei, Guiyuan in Ningxia Hui Autonomous Region and Lanzhou in Gansu Province. I have taken pictures of the wild goose pagoda in Xi'an, the sea in Sanya, the food of Wuzhong, the yellow river in Lanzhou. Everywhere I went, I was amazed by the different beauty of China and moved by the kindness and friendship of Chinese people as I recorded all these beautiful movements with my camera. My first impression of China is beautiful and friendly. As I live in China longer and learn more about China, I found that there are still so many places waiting for me to explore. Just like when I went to Xi'an, big wild goose pagoda, when I saw it for the first time, I was so amazed. It looks so different. But when I get closer to it, touch its brick walls and felt its history, I found that it was not only different, but it also contains ancient civilization and Chinese wisdom. In the absence of modern technology at that time, they were able to build such a high and beautiful tower, which condensed the wisdom and spirit of Chinese craftsmen. Besides the sweet and delicious taste of the babo tea that I drank in Wuzhong, leaves the flavor in my mouth and on my lips for a long time. It has the function to nourish the in, moisturize the lungs, clear and relieve the throat, which is unique combination of Chinese cuisine and medicine. I am really amazed by all of this. I think that my understanding of China is only a small part. I want to use my camera to record the unique beauty of China, experience a more realistic and three-dimensional China and let more foreigners know what I have understand and what I have learned. If I could sum up China in one word, it would be unique. China has a unique civilization and unique culture and unique wisdom. I like these and I love China.